back. Today I got this uh, keyboard from iPassport. Now, if you guys are interested, as always, check the description below. I try to hook you guys up with the latest and greatest stuff right there. Um, I got to say, this thing is extremely light. I've been able to test this out on the NVIDIA Shield, on the Fire Stick, on the Meat Cool. Um, yeah, this thing just works great. Now, this is a Bluetooth keyboard. Um, what do you get in the box? It's pretty much this. If you flip it over, you could stick a Fire Stick remote, um, or you could swap it out to this one. Your keyboard will go here, and then I have yet to figure out. I tried in the NVIDIA Shield, but the NVIDIA Shield is too long, the old remote. Definitely not the new remote because it's triangular, but I have a feeling it's for the Google one. So, yeah, you guys uh, let me know in the comment section below. There's also a user guide and no power supply, but you do get the cable for it. Um, you just plug it in. This thing works for months on a single charge. Um, then of course it depends on your use. If you use it a lot, then it might, might be a month, <laughs> might be a couple weeks. I don't know. Um, but yeah, want to show you guys how this thing works now. Very, very simple. There is a button right here to turn on. So once you turn it on, this thing will start flashing lights will start turning on. Um, there is a button option right here. If you do turn that on to turn red. And then uh, if you don't want it on, then just turn it off and then that's it. Now, when you want to turn on the Bluetooth, this mode here has to be shining blue. The way to do that is you have to do FN and right next to the FN is a BT. That's Bluetooth. That's 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 pairing mode. You do this for any Bluetooth. That's anything that's Bluetooth compatible. You'll be able to find it. Um, so here we go. Let's go ahead and click on this. Hold that BT. And now my beat now my now my, my blue light right here is shining. So or it's blinking, I should say. So we're gonna come to the capture device. And here is the fire stick. Gonna go far right, click on that settings, come down and click on controllers and Bluetooth devices. Now go to other Bluetooth devices, select Bluetooth, and notice I'm still blinking here. Click on I passport Bluetooth. Give it a few seconds, and this is the same step for the Shield or for any streaming device that has Bluetooth. Now, I'm just going to use this thing right here. Um, right here on the side uh, where the numbers are, you're going you're to see some numbers right here. That's where your up, down, left, right is. And also, there you have a home button here to click on, and it'll send you right back to the home. Or let's just say you're like, hey, well, I'm over here within my settings and I'm clicking on, I'm already on this thing. There's an enter button here that works just fine. Also the space bar works as an enter. If you click on that back button, it will start backing you all the way up. Pretty nice. There is also a fast forward, um, skip, reverse, play, pause. Um, there is a, the, the hamburger button right there and also a magnifying glass, which I thought was I'm like, I wonder if this thing works. So if I just go to search Disney, um, and as you can see, it's already popping up. I just start scrolling down. I hit, here's a space bar. Again, works as enter. Boom, there it is. Or I can hit the actual enter button. Boom, there it is. Very, very simple here. So I'm going to hit that home button to get out of there. But this thing works really good. Now, if I do want to pair, because some people are like, wait, how do I unpair this thing if I wanted to give it to somebody? Go back to your settings, How the same exact steps, how you paired it. You want to go there. You want to go here to your other Bluetooth devices. Now, here's the only thing that's different. You want to find this, this one, whatever it's called. This one's like Passport Bluetooth. And this one says, press the hamburger button to unpair. The other ones can, might, might just say, click it, unpair, and you just hit unpair. This one, I hit the hamburger. Now it says, pre, please press select to discontinue so i'm going to hit the enter button and now it says i am now disconnected so if i click on this it's no longer going to work and there it goes so all done it disappeared and we're good let me know what you guys think about this one this thing has been very very nice and i know you fire stick users constantly are looking for something that's that's your option right there that's the one that you're going to want to get let me know what you guys think i have a couple of these things here so i can hook you guys up with let me know in the comment section below as always you guys take care take care of each other and i'll see you guys in the next one take care guys